Welcome to the Online Meditation Center. Today we will look at what is the most optimal way of meditating, mindset-wise. What kind of mindset should you be in? in order to, you could say, achieve a state of pure meditation as quickly as possible. And then being able to keep it intact for as long as you want. Usually when people sit down to meditate, it might go something like this. I sit down, close my eyes, and I think, okay, now I have to meditate. I need to be quiet. When meditating, my mind has to be silent. Okay, trying to be silent. Trying to be silent. Hmm, I wonder what I need to buy in the grocery store. Mm, I need to be quiet. I am meditating, after all, I have to be quiet. So, instead of like being aware of the silence which is actually already there in the midst of all the chaos and all the thoughts and everything that's going on, they try to force their mind to be quiet. Which is like a prescription for disaster. At least a prescription for not being quiet. So rather than thinking, you know, this is, this is one way, of course. But it's, I imagine, a pretty effective way for those who struggle to be silent. Because the problem is not being silent. The problem is removing everything else that you think you have to do. Either it's something you have to do in order to meditate, or it's something you have to do in the external world. You know, chores, jobs, kids, family, friends, meetings, parties, whatever. But meditating, you're just here, and that's it. So if you can sit down, and instead of trying to meditate, trying to become silent, what if you instead just realize that I'm here. And whatever meditation is or means, it's the opposite of going out into the world or fiddling with things inside of the mind. It's the opposite of doing something. It's the opposite of going somewhere. It's the opposite of achieving anything. And what does that mean? It means it's already done. It's already complete. So if you can sit down and tell yourself, if you have to tell yourself something in order to start a meditation session, and tell yourself, I am already complete. I am already finished. I am at the end point right now. If meditation is the opposite of every movement, whether internal or, or external, if meditation is the opposite of anything which tries to do something, 
then it means it's already done. It means you are already complete. So if a thought comes saying anything, you just watch it, knowing it's not true. Right now, I'm complete. So that's why it might help to set an alarm for, you know, some period of time, maybe five minutes, maybe 15 minutes, maybe half an hour, or if a little bit hardcore, maybe an hour, or if you're really hardcore, then three hours, however long that period of meditation. For those minutes, for those hours, you are complete. You are already at the destination. You're already at the end point. So you just sit there. And whatever appears in your mind, you watch it. Detached. And if it tries to shake you into doing something, then you just tell it, mm -mm. right now, I'm already complete. I'm not going anywhere. This is it. And you breathe. And you listen. And you feel your body. You don't listen for anything specific. You don't breathe to be done breathing. You just listen. You just feel. You just breathe. In this void of completeness. Because you cannot achieve meditation anyway. Because meditation is what is looking out through your eyes. So it's already complete. The silence is already here. Thus, don't try to meditate. Simply realize that you're complete. You're already finished. There's nowhere to go in order to do what you're trying to do. So that must mean if I'm complete, then every breath I take is completeness. Everything I hear is fulfillment. Everything I sense is perfection. And it's not going anywhere. It's not trying to do anything. It's not trying to reach a goal. It's just completeness existing. And in this knowledge or awareness of not going anywhere, of being already finished, your mind might relax. everything might slow down. The chaos will slowly, slowly silence itself. And there you have meditation. So don't try to meditate. Just understand that everything else is complete. Try it at least. And don't hesitate to let me know if you need any help. Have a great day.